Hi, welcome back to my channel. This is Miss Stiff, and the purpose of the video today is to give you the backstory to the track He Won't on my debut album, Schooled. Okay, so this is the first full track on the album, and the the backstory is I made this track while the hook for it while in the shower tipsy after a night of being around the ladies and I'm in and out hearing things in different rooms we're chatting it up all over the place and I overhear you know um just just minor complaints about like this is good about the guy but then this is not good and it took me back to a place where I once was you know because I could relate so this song is meant to be it's written to be relatable to um anyone who is in the position receiving um ill treatment from a man child or a narcissist um if you follow the words to the track you know you know He'll lay you right. He'll feed you right. He's always going to look good. He'll give you some thrills, pay all the bills. Like, this person will do everything to keep you from talking seriously about the, the negative, right? So, there is an imbalance in the treatment, but the, the positives, the superficial material positives outweigh the the moral and the emotional bankruptcy okay so and it's like we're basically talking about a narcissist right so if you if you speak out against it you know all these other treasures and treatments and thrills go away right but he's not even emotionally invested anyways and the part of it the biggest part of it is that it didn't, the bond of the relationship was not formed honestly. And speaking from my experience and like some of the things like I kind of caught from, caught wind of other people that I knew that went through this as well. If that man child, if that narcissist, if that person forms a connection or relationship with you while having an existing one going on with someone else, if they crush somebody for you and you allow it and don't speak against it, you know, regardless of who initiated it, if, if you allow that or participate, they're not going to respect you, never going to respect you. And let's say you do initiate and you crush or step on the toes of somebody else to get that, that man child or that narcissist. You're going to pay dearly because you, no matter what he does for you, he will never respect you. And I don't care if you substitute this with a she, it doesn't matter. Okay. So the purpose is to don't ignore red flags and begin with the end mind. The same way you begin is the same way you want to continue to the end. This is something I live by. This is something I figured out very early in age. And every time I went against it, I paid early. So, <laughs> but I mean, we're here and we're experimenting, but you gotta be careful with some of that experimentation, you know? And I'm telling you that these lyrics not only ring true for my life, and I did it once, stepped on the toes of someone else, and never ever was respected by that individual. Didn't matter. And I was, and let me tell you, Speaking of the man child or whatever, if if you look if you're good for them and you keep them up in terms of social appearance, right? If you come off as that prize, because they're gonna keep their prize anywhere in their life, and that's true, that could be true for anybody. Okay, if you add a richness or a value, oh, you could be kept, but that doesn't necessarily ensure uh proper treatment. Um, you know, social, emotionally behind closed doors. Okay. So they will pretend to be supportive of you and protective of you and really offer none of those things, only just the superficial material. And that's all connected to, uh, you know, his image. All right. So I hope this video was useful for anyone who did figure out or didn't um 
pick up on the meaning or the purpose of that track or what the back, you know, have an idea what that uh, backstory was. Because you kind of can get the gist and you may not. Um, but I felt like it was important. I wanted to share this because sometimes we just, sometimes when we're going through things, we just need to know that we're validated, um, you know, with our ideas, our thoughts, and our feelings, and even our actions too. So um, check out the track if you haven't already. And or go back and give it another listen and see if this backstory ch- helps you to notice something you never noticed before. All right, more to come. Um, that's only the first full track on the album. Next up will be Oh No. Later.